Police in Germany have raided the homes of the co-pilot of the German wings plane that uh, crashed into the French Alps on Tuesday. With more, we turn to Paul Yi at the News Center. Paul, this young pilot has been accused of killing all 150 people on board, including himself. Were there any warning signs that might have caused him to snap? Well, investigators say they have evidence suggesting he had tried to hide an illness from his employer and fellow colleagues. Now, earlier, a German tabloid reported he underwent psychiatric treatment for serious depression six years ago. Attention is being focused on two homes linked to the 28-year-old pilot named Andreas Lupus, who was suspected of flying the aircraft into the mountainside. On Friday, police and swarms of journalists descended on a house in Montebor, believed to belong to his parents. In the meantime, aviation security experts say the incident represented a lapse in flight regulations. The failing here is only allowing one person in the cockpit at any one stage. I would either say it's an absolute rule that no matter what is happening, there should always be two people in the cockpit, or alternatively, if you do need to leave, then there should be someone else who is trained to fly or has a rudimentary knowledge uh, that can come in and stand in. Several airlines have responded immediately by changing their rules to require a second crew member to be in the cockpit at all times. Meanwhile, helicopters are continuing the search and recovery operation over the crash site in hopes of finding the second black box data recorder.